Dave coming to you from ANSRB here in Midland. Believe it or not, it's April 18th, and as you can probably see here, it's snowing. So, perfect day for a video, right? Today we're going to feature the Riverside Retro. This is the model 135. So, let's get started. So first here, do a walk around to the outside. It has a power tongue jack, as you can see there, with the docking light. Propane tank holder, battery rail there. And as we did on the one video, uh, let's see if we can get some of the shot of the roof here. So hopefully you saw that. There's Josh, one of our technicians, driving the fork truck around. So, on this side, we're gonna have our storage compartment. Get a view of that. That's where the tank is. And then you can see all the rest of the storage there. This one is the retro floor, so it's the black and white checkered floor. And then you have another, uh, option to get into your storage there so it is pass-through storage so as we go along the door side you see it's got the retro rim big door side campsite window outdoor speakers with your power awning there's your refrigerator exhaust you have some outlets there and then there's your furnace exhaust and a propane, quick propane hookup. This does have the four stabilizers, and very important to have those down on this model. Uh, there we have our entry step. There's a good view of the back of the RV there. And then on the off door side, pretty standard, you have your window, outdoor shower, your, furn or your water heater, and then you have your connections there for solar, 30 amp, and then you have a cable connection there. With your rim for the other side, and then actually there's your dump takes there. Well, let's take a look inside. Well, there's the model number, 135. Outside light there. As we head inside, to our right, we have our Dometic refrigerator with wood grain panels. There's a shot of the floor, as we saw in the pass-through storage. There is your furnace, and we have your dinette here, which can turn to a little bed. Storage above. And there's the head unit for your radio. And we have your storage there on top of the bed. This bed is your east-west bed there. That is your uh, comforter. And it has storage compartments here. Well, that lifts up there. And there's your emergency exit window. There's a little snapshot of the unit, which you actually have marked down to $15,995 right now. So. Very good deal on this cute little unit. More storage, you have your microwave, standard microwave, hood fan, you have your two burner cooktop, your sink, and then you have some storage underneath there. And we move around here, there's a little shot of the air conditioning. Here we have your TV connections so this wall is a backer so you can mount a TV there your control panel your fire extinguisher there and last but not least we have the bathroom 
So max air fan there. Here you have your shower with the dome light. Picture of that. And then a separate toilet. So usually in this size camper, you'll have what they call a wet bath, which the bathroom or the toilet is inside of the shower. And uh, so when you're taking a shower, toilet's in there. When you're on the toilet, you're in the shower. Uh, so this is what they call a dry bath, which is a unique feature of this model. The toilet's separate from the shower. So hope you enjoyed this video and stay tuned. I'll, I'll have some more coming to you. Thanks for watching.